Ladies and gentlemen, heroes come in many forms. As we open tonight's Parent Booster Award presentation, we first pay tribute to the memory of two of these heroes. Tom Barnett was the 2011 recipient of the Patrick John Hughes Parent Booster Award. Mr. Barnett gave the Ben Davis Marching Band Program over 40 years of dedication, hard work, friendship, and care, not only to his own children, but thousands whom he treated as if they were. In August, shortly before he succumbed to cancer, he was named an honorary Ben Davis Band Director, and tonight we remember and again salute him. And Officer Rod Bradway, a dedicated and loving husband and loving and active parent booster with children in the Decatur Central High School Band. A member of the Indianapolis Metro Police Department, Officer Bradway was slain in the line of duty on September 20th, 2013, while coming to the aid of a victim of domestic violence. Victor Hugo once said, music expresses that which cannot be put into words. Orchestra students from Ben Davis, Avon, and Carmel High Schools, and their directors, Amy Noble, Dean Westman, and Sue Han, are honored to come together tonight to help pay tribute to Mr. Barnett, Officer Bradway, and all of the moms and dads, past and present, the everyday and extraordinary heroes who have made positively life-changing experiences in the lives of children.
Joining Music for All's president and CEO, Eric Martin, on stage to help present our next award, please welcome Mrs. Jamie Bradway and Sierra and Jonathan Bradway, and representing Mr. Barnett's family, his son-in-law, Mr. Dale Rolfson. The Patrick John Hughes Parent Booster Award recognizes the extraordinary commitment, dedication, support, and sacrifice of music parents and boosters across the nation by shining a spotlight on a recipient who exemplifies these qualities. The finalists for the 2013 award are all inspiring, dedicated individuals and worthy nominees. Gene Hunter, Mountain Crest High School, Utah. Johnny Hahn, Hillcrest High School, Arizona. Stephen Clintworth, Woodland Middle School, Riverdale High School, and Ravenwood High School, Tennessee. Susan Kurvitsky, Freedom High School, Florida. And Tom Meyer, Blue Springs High School, Missouri. And now, let's meet the winner of the 2013 Patrick John Hughes Parent Booster Award. Mr. Dick Zentner first became involved with the Norwin Band Boosters in the 1980s when his daughter was a member of the Color Guard. As Mr. Zentner's other children continued their participation in the Norwin Band Program, so did he. Not only was he a supporter of the Norwin Band Program, he often met with other schools, fledgling band parent organizations, and shared with them the Norwin Booster model and the wisdom of his experience. Mr. Zentner became a trusted confidant and friend of Norwin Director of Bands and Bands of America Hall of Fame member, the late L.J. Hancock. Though Mr. Zentner's youngest son graduated from the band program in 1994, he continued to serve and advise. After more than 25 years of involvement and assisting with the transition of four band directors, Mr. Zentner has become an icon of the Norwin Band. Says Director of Bands Timothy Daniels, in many ways Dick is the keeper of the Norwin Band tradition, which is truly part of what makes the Norwin Band program successful. Mr. Zentner has not only been a booster, pit crew dad, equipment truck driver, logistics specialist, prop construction crew member, volunteer coordinator, president of the Norwin Band Aids, band historian, and director of operations. He's also been a true advocate of music education and a champion of every student. Linda Hancock, a former Norwin Band instructor and sister of legendary director L.J. Hancock says, Year after year, rehearsal after rehearsal, performance after performance, Dick is there doing what needs to be done because he knows the importance of supporting the efforts of the student. Dick Zentner is the epitome of a dedicated band booster. Please join me in congratulating the 2013 recipient of the Patrick John Hughes Parent Booster Award, serving Norwin High School in Pennsylvania, Mr. Dick Zentner. Mr. Zentner is being escorted to the stage by 2008 winner Dan Adams, serving American Fork High School, Utah, and 2012 winner P.J. Littleton, serving Franklin High School and Hillsborough Middle School in Tennessee. The award is being presented by Mr. Dale Rolfson. Joining us tonight to celebrate Mr. Zentner's award are his son, Ron Zentner, daughter, Don Tatters, grandsons, Dylan and Doug Tatters, and student members, fellow boosters, and band directors, past and present, of the Norwin High School Band. Good evening. I'm uh, very humbled and quite overwhelmed by all of this. 
but I'm also very grateful to Bands of America and everyone associated with this award. I'm quite sure there are many people out there that are equally, if not more, deserving of me than this. A dear departed friend, L.J. Hancock, who you just saw on the screen up there, a charter member of the Bands of America Hall of Fame, used to say you had three elements you needed for a successful music program. You need total uh, commitment and dedication from the students, from the uh, instructional staff, and from the parents. If one of those are lacking, you're not going to achieve the performance levels that we all strive for. Um, I accept this award tonight, not only for me, but for the countless unnamed and unknown volunteers and boosters out there working behind the scenes to keep things rolling. You are all heroes in the eyes of the students in your various programs. Keep up the great work, guys. Thank you. Congratulations, Mr. Zentner. Thank you to all the band parents here tonight and watching online. You are truly heroes in our eyes.